Morning, morning, guys. Welcome to today's episode of Kent's Fishing. And goodness, I had to stop here to do this intro because that backdrop is unbelievable. Have a look at that. Waters looking machine. This looks like it could be a scene from Game of Thrones or something. It's just, this coastline is just so beautiful, man. So we're in um, Kazan this morning and uh, we're coming to have a fish out here. We're going to give it our all and hopefully we get some fish for you guys, man. But um, come along with us this morning. The guys, the crew, everybody's already on the rocks there. I'm lagging a bit behind this morning and whew, it's a crisp nine degrees. Uh, water is going out already. So, but it's spring tide, so you know the water's still quite high. And um, we've got all sorts of gear set up for, for this morning's fish. We're gonna try for whatever we can get. So stay tuned for that. I'm gonna head over to the rocks there and we'll catch you in the water. See you this morning. And that gear I was talking about, guys, we got all sorts. We're gonna try for some live shad first this morning. Canteen, whatever live is you can get. And just have fun, man. You can get bronzies here, brush here, all sorts. So let's meet up the guys here. How many fish you caught already? Derek? I think you can put a bike in yet. Not yet, okay. That was the only one that's Where is he? Darren's in the water already. Oh, okay. Short. Cool, man. Drift bait, huh? Smashing the drift line. Second one. Yeah. Watching. Oh, there's a leper. A nice size shed, huh? Beautiful. Well done. Short. Also a drift bait. Uh, it's a couple of battle sinkers just to help me cross a bit. And we should go tight with the shed in five minutes, probably. Two minutes, one minute. Real up, real up. Right to the Yeah, they're sitting right on the shed. Huh? Not getting on now? They're sitting on the top, on the shed. There we go, Derek. On. Nice to catch fish again, man. One nice to get shared again. What's up? My body. Yeah. Oh, nice one, eh? Nice one, yo. Nice one, well done. I'm gonna try a bit of top bang. Let's see what happens with the top bang. On, dad's on again. No, came off. No, it's still on. No, off. Came off, I think. No, it's on, it's on. Hey, a nice size too, eh? Yo, that's a lucky one. Jeez, another 400, huh? Hey boy. Nice one. Ah, they seem to be around that, that rock there, eh? They seem to be around that rock there, Darren. The big holes, yeah. Yeah. Right here in the front. Hey, on. Good feeling, eh? 
Alle an Höhe. Nee, ich kann. Ich kann mich nicht. Oh, das ist Kaffee vom Vorarzt, ja? Oh, nice one, Darren. Oh. What's up by the 400, I think? And on. There we go. Yay! Doing some aerial moves there. This one's doing some acrobats. Yo! Yes, that's true. That's a bigger one, I think. Up. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's nice. Blue shed, eh? Blue shed, Lani. I think mine is the biggest so far. Yeah, looks like it. Let's see. Now there's some big ones in the eggs, eh? Let me just put it on this on this thing, yeah? Just to show the guys in proportion. Huh? Check those lannies. Is there a price for the biggest one? Yeah. What's that? Get a free beer. Bantuk. <laughs> Bantuk Lager. There's a cooler box just to give you an idea of the size. Yes, that's the one you were looking for. Shot. Yes, boy, boy. Well done. Thanks. Pick the size on that one. Go. Good size, man. Jeez, like, look at that. Let's put it on the box so you can see. Yo, 400 maybe. Oh, yes. Oh, that feels better. Blue shed. And that's me done. Four. No live I've yet. caught my four already, bro. No, you won't find a live in the They're all yeah. big ones, yeah. Short man. Try for something else now. Huh? I'm gonna try for something else now. Nice one. Oh, that looks like a bigger one than mine. Jeez, like it. It's a nice one, eh? Same. 42 to the fork. Changing over to a plug and Darren's pulling one, yeah. Whoa! Just came off. I'm just gonna put a plug on and check what's lurking. Wow, ladies just caught uh, the biggest black tail I've ever seen. It's probably 40 centimeters maybe. And another one, double up. Awesome. Well done ladies. Yo. Yo. Yeah. Really good. Yeah. Oh, well done again. Thank you. Cheers. Are you gonna put it back? Derek! In your element. I'm in my element. Now you got what, what you this is all the way from Trafalgar to uh Gazan, man. It's all followed you, Derek. Nice one, Derek. Well done. Beautiful bronzy. Absolutely. Just gave us a caro, yeah? Let's see if we can slide him out. Yeah. Ah, looking for pool, yeah, Lani. Got that net there still, huh, Darren? Tim, man. Tim, man. Tim says he knows us from YouTube. Can you believe that? And when will tell a lie, huh? you staying here? Sorry? You're living here? Yeah, I'm living here. Wow. So you saw all of us? Okay. 
that's interesting okay guys i'm gonna cast this grapnel out and then slide it live quarantine I decided to put them this way today. Yeah. Right, huh? And then we start the shakes. There's a, there's a cavity on the top of the eye. It's a hard cavity. It's a hard cavity. <laughs> You've just been putting hooks in there, Mark. I know, I know. It's like, <laughs> no, don't feel bad. It's like a, just a. I would do the same. Most probably, right? See there. Here we go. Let me get a scissor to put that now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And then the second one goes through there. This is amazing. How did you learn to do that? That. So. Can I tighten the bottom one a little bit? No. No? No, that's the carrying hook. Got it? That is. Yeah. Other one? Flash. Yeah. So what that does, it doesn't put any pressure on the fish. The fish will stay alive much longer because the pressure is on the hook. Okay. Yeah, the thing. And then that thing? we're going to wind onto that line and then we push it down like a fufu slide. Yeah, uh, battled a bit for, for the, uh, before the first wave. So that coil will go around the line. How's my throwing, Danny? Perfect. And you lock it in position there. See that last clasp? clips in there and that's it and then we slide him down make it tight down tighten up oh your top eye came off slide oh slide it out first we'll sort it out yeah yeah it's broken in the thingy there so there's no way we can use it now And luckily he's carried his extra tip and that is a quick change of it looks like looks like his um, rod might have bumped against something but anyway this is why he had that spare tip with him send it let it slow him down Darren let it slow him down It'll take a little bit of a while. It's going already. It's going already. Yeah, shot. Tight here with a, whoa, a bass of a bronze beam. My goodness. You are so steric. Well done, Tim, for getting it to us. With the, with the top bang? What? What do you say, Derek? Oh, okay, no. That's your normal bronzy choice. Yes, yes. 
No, that's a bronze green. That's a bus. Yo, Derek Pam was gonna be happy with this. <laughs> hey? Well done, man. Short. Oh, your missus is gonna be happy with that, eh? Yo. I gotta get a photo with you right there. Oh, we put it in the Yeah. Tim went down and fetched it. I saw it down there. Like, he said to me, Where you know Tim from? Measure it, Derek. Eh? Where you know Tim from? From here. Have you checked one of the pictures? Never. First time seeing one so big. Eh? That's a bus. 48. Yo, 48. Yo, 48. Well done, Derek. Yo. How big? 48. What? Oh, thanks guys, not a bad morning. Gazan delivered. <laughs> Got some lacquer shed. Some uh, vast bronzy. Sure, how's this run? Monster bronzy. So Derek was in his element. Absolutely. Yo, I'm so happy you got that fish, man. But Derek hasn't been feeling well this trip so far. Suddenly, he's just feeling hundreds again. It's definitely his day today. <laughs> the bronze is like medicine for him. <laughs> True. And uh, yeah, I'm just happy we all got fish, man. Bring the confidence up again. So uh, join us a little later. We're going to be heading out on yeah. the boat just now. And Darren, we're off to the river, eh? Yeah, we're going to fish on the river. Our boy boy is going to try and get some live mullets for us. Yeah. And let's see if we can get that elusive Cob. Yeah man, that's a really, that'll be Maybe a bonus. A Absolute bonus. Maybe a grunter or two. Hey, that's it. Hey, on our so wish list. make this afternoon session count. Definitely. Yeah. But all in all, like a day man, top, this place top. is beautiful. Sure. Yeah. Unbelievable weather too, huh? Stunning today. Well, we'll catch you on the boat. Afternoon guys. Yeah, we're gonna head out on the boat just now. That's our ride there behind me. And uh, we just want to try and get some live mullet before we head out. I want to check our guide, Boy Boy, check his method of cast. Because as you know, I'm still battling, I'm learning still, but getting there. We put some in here yesterday. Don't know if they're still there. It's a corner. Sure. Okay, we're gonna try and get some more. Derek, how are you? Good, how are you? Shop man. Shop, shop man. Oh, does it? Punch it out in one hand, grab the bottom, throw it over. Okay, twice. Perfect, huh? That was a parcel, huh? Yo. Hey. Guys, we're about to voyage, go on this voyage this afternoon. Uh, as we said, we're going to do a boat session. Vernon's our skipper, and we've got the whole crew here. Even Boy Boy is there. Boy Boy, in corner. <laughs> So sit back, relax, and watch us catch some fish, man. While we're waiting for some action on the big sticks, we've got this little Assassin Slayer, seven foot heavy, and I've paired it with the same R55. Just gonna rig up a bucktail. Darren, you also got a black bucktail on there. Cool. You never know about the colors there. Some guys like the white ones, some guys like the black ones. But I think as long as there's movement, yeah, color doesn't really matter. It's just a preference, I think.
nine species that we get in here besides Cape Carrick and Cobb. Grunter. It's the third most. Yeah. Those are your predominant species here. You can see the perch. We've got grass cobb here before. Sharks. Um, and you will get rock salmon, but very few. Uh, this, this is a lot of action. Yeah. Dad, take this. Okay, take yours, huh? What are you doing? Oh, tighten, tighten the drag there. Ah, Just... lock pulled. Lock pulled? Yeah. Okay, she here. No, no. Oh, there's one down. Yeah, something took him. Just leave the fish in the water. Hey, I have a nice take there. Mm. Obviously, didn't swallow it enough. We're gonna head out to sea and we're gonna look for some live mackerel and if we don't get some liveies then we're gonna drop a bottom trace for some cat face rock or something let's go check it out okay so guys when we go through the surf zone you need to just look ahead we go over a wave ride the boat with the wave don't look away or close your eyes or no, okay. no, no. If it's not safe, I turn around and come back. So you've got nothing to worry about. Okay. Perfect. Thanks, also, brother. Also, if something, if you lose something, leave it. Don't try and get it until we're through the surf zone. Okay? okay. And don't move, please. Whatever you do, yeah. don't move to the other side of the boat or whatever. Okay. Just yeah. stay exactly where you are until we're through the surf zone. Okay. Got right. it, Skipper. Cheers. Oh yeah! 
How's that, Darren? Next to the boat. Going with the boat. Right next to the boat. Cool, thanks. You can't take off. Ronan's just helping Darren tie one of the Azuris. And then we're gonna flick it out for some macro. Boy, boy. Yeah. One little Mac. Drop the bait. Yeah. We're trolling live valleys in the river again. Uh, it's just like the sea. It's a little bit bumpy. Just a little bit. Too many bottles. Too many bottles, yeah. Well then, thanks again. That was awesome, man. Yeah. As my dad was saying, maybe just a few too many bottles for me. <laughs> but once we came into the river, all hundreds again. Yeah. Guys, we've given it our best. You saw different baits. And unfortunately, no takers. So this evening, we're going to try. We'll slide out those, Mali, down in the front. Yeah. Maybe we'll be lucky shed. with, yeah, yeah. maybe yeah. a cob or something. Yeah. yeah. So stay tuned for that. And uh, again, Vernon, thanks again. Only a Shot. pleasure. Yeah. Cheers, Next bro. time, better luck. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> cool, man. Cheers. Cheers. Guys, if you ever need a guide, a good old boy boy is the man. I don't know if he's available to everybody because Vernon actually, it's uh, he works with Vernon. He works for the resort. And uh, man, I just wanted to say, boy boy, it's a wonga kuru. Okay, I'm not going to go. Yo, I'm not going to go. 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 Dissolved in a bit of boiling water, and you can see that's darkened it a little bit. So just want that to reduce down a bit. And once it's cooked up, and I'm happy with that, so we'll put the shad in towards the end, and then the, the cook on the shad is pretty quick. I was happy with the base sauce. Mm -hmm. Tasted my salt. Salt was tasting good. So the shad's just gone in now. Oh. It's looking machine, huh? What do you so, reckon, Derek? That looks like a new for a king there. Okay, so... It's starting to smell machine to me. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I'm just going to keep it closed. I'm going to keep it closed because the shed actually like poaches in the yeah, curry. Yeah, it's Absolutely, yeah. It. Yeah. yeah. Steams through. For about... 15 minutes, maybe. Hundreds. Yeah. And, and you... And I'll try and turn them over before they get too soft. Just turn, just turn it in a little bit. But if you leave it too long, then they're going to get too soft and then they just break up. So yeah, yeah. leave it after five minutes and just turn them a bit and then, then hey. they can poach through. Hundreds. You know, if there's any leftovers tomorrow, then oh, it's going to taste better. It's normally good mm, the following there. day. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. God is. Or any curry, any good curry yeah. is better yeah. the next day. Yeah. I think the spices just soak in nicely. into it like yeah. I yeah. yeah sweet yeah that's looking really really good so it's pretty much cooked huh? yep smells lucker cooked. I'm gonna turn it off now so it doesn't get yes. is it you Yes, it's smelling. Here we go. So what we got here, guys, is some uh, carrot salad. Carrot salad. Got some shad curry fresh from Kazan and some homemade rotis. You made the rotis too, bro? Yeah, I made it now. <laughs> Short, Darren. Yeah. Well, let's try it. Hopefully, it tastes like. Yeah. That's it. Hey, it smells like it. Mm, absolutely. Can 
Cheers. <laughs> I'm waiting patiently. Eleven kilo and nine kilo. Ah, that's okay. That's like a. You need to pound coal. So we start coal. What you reckon? Top one hundred percent. Awesome. Mm. We had a taste yet, eh? Mm. Machine. This is what the doctor ordered. For the, for the vertigo. Hey, bro. <laughs> I'm starting to feel alive again. <coughs> Came in good spirits. Living in good spirits. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. You have bloody maybe. Maybe even higher. Higher. <laughs> no, true. Lanis, guys, thank you very much for, for watching this series. Um, I hope you all enjoyed it. We certainly did. Lots of fun, lots of highlights. And I just wanted to say thank you to the guys behind me, yeah? Derek, Not as always. Hey, bro. Good. Dad, yeah. what an experience to, to have together. And uh, special moments, yeah? Darren, for looking after us with all the chows, man. Chow. Yo. Keeping uh, us. We have, to, we have to make sure the O's are fed. Eh? Keeping us. for the good company. <laughs> I, think, I think we're all leaving it slightly heavier than we arrived. <laughs> oh, I think so. <laughs> we, got some, we got heavy cooler boxes too. Yeah. <laughs> and heavy mileage on the shoes. Huh? Yeah. Mileage. Got some cooler boxes there. Eh? How many steps? Plenty steps. <laughs> yeah. Just one. Yo. Jim. <sighs> When you when, when, body workout. <laughs> when you're a fisherman, you don't eat. Yeah, you know. mountain climbing, all sorts. Yeah. One stage, I thought I'm gonna pop my knee there. Ab work, <laughs> <laughs> carbs, anything. Yeah, I know. Look, uh, we didn't get the Garrick, we didn't get the cob, but we're definitely coming back. Yeah, we've learned a hell of a lot. Eh? Yeah. Absolutely. Um, this was our first experience, master. Yeah. So it's a learning curve, and we'll come back wiser. Definitely. Sure. sure. Almost definitely. There's just so much to explore still on our coast, not just the Eastern Cape. So I actually want to challenge all you Lanis. Take a short left, go with your families, get out there as long as it's not locked down or anything like that. Yeah. Support local, uh, which brings me to the next one, to Vernon and his team at the Spotted Grunters Resort. Man, thanks for your hospitality. Yeah, it was good. Yeah. It was really good. Friendly staff. Uh, you can see that this is not just the business. They really do take, um, they they really uh, take an interest in the sport. All the staff, all the staff. All the staff. Uh, and our boy boys. Yo, our guide. What a what a what a what a gentleman ah, and, a, and a squire. Top, yeah. top, top 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 top. So guys, thank you very much for watching and uh, PSJ 21, 2021 done. Uh, there's lacquer, uh, there's, there's just too much to talk about, you've seen it in all of the videos, so keep on supporting and thanks for all the guys that have subscribed, if you haven't yet subscribed, come Lani, subscribe please man, and uh, hit, those, hit, the bell, no, hit the bell so that you can be notified with video uploads, so from all of us, cheers, cheers guys, cheers, cheers man, shots.